DeSantis mobilizes Florida State Guard to ward off expected wave of Haitian migrants. Yeah, it's great, good stuff. DeSantis, off the campaign trail, back in Florida, taking care of his state. Good, good, good. I, I honestly, you know, I, I wouldn't be too, uh, I wouldn't be, I wouldn't be too against the idea of Senator Ron DeSantis. Just, I'm just, I'm okay with them now, you know. Uh, I'm definitely not a president, okay? Because <laughs> we don't want anybody drone striking Mexico, right? Like he wanted to do. But yes, he's mobilizing the state guard, other elements of the government, and this is to ward off an expected wave of Haitian migrants as the Caribbean nation descends further into chaos. Fun fact. Uh, there was once a boat of about 800 Libyans on its way to uh, Greece. You know how the Greek did de dealt with that ship? They fired a torpedo at it. Yeah, they're all gone. Yeah, yeah, kind of, kind of an efficient, but very efficient way to deal with them, right? You don't have to waste anyone's wages. Like, oh, we have to capture you and provide you food and you know, uh, document you and then send you back to ha Haiti. Yeah, no. No, no, no. Torpedoes. We love torpedoes, just like uh, Trump's lawyers, right? The Sanders posted on Twitter on Wednesday about his move to protect Florida. For quite some time, the state of Florida has been dis dis dedicating significant resources to combat illegal vessels coming to Florida from countries such as Haiti. Given the circumstances in Haiti, I have directed the division of... This is a quote from him. Dur during... Given the circumstances in Hades, I have directed the Division of Emergency Management, the Florida State Guard, and state law enforcement agencies to deploy over 250 additional officers and soldiers and over a dozen air and sea craft to the southern coast of Florida to protect our state. No state has done more to supplement the under-resourced U.S. Coast Guard's interdiction efforts. We cannot have illegals coming to Florida. Yeah, that's true. Uh, so that's a that's a full statement. Uh, Matt Gates reiterated his call for the Biden administration to position the Navy to interdict the expected wave of Haitian migrants. He says, I don't want Southeast Florida to become Haiti. I'm calling on JB to do the right thing and declare an anticipated, an anticipated state of mass migration over water. That way we could get naval vessels in Florida Straits to deter the thousands of incoming Haitians before they invade the U.S. That's a good idea, Matt. Yeah. Governor Matt Gates. I like that. I like the sound of that, right? Yeah. yeah. And the reason why I'm calling for that is because um, uh, there's, there's term limits and decide, DeSantis can't run again. And I think Matt Gates would be a, a swell replacement. He needs some executive experience before he becomes president. So Florida's voice reported... Uh, Haitian-born Florida State Representative Ber uh, Bernie Jacques supports the action by DeSantis. Okay, okay, okay. Here you see, we've got the Haitian man, and he's like, I don't want those uh, those OG Haitians here because <laughs> they are problems, right? There are lots of problems there. 